Why didn't the dad like his new drill? Because he felt it was a little bit boring. <laughs> What's that? Don't forget, comment your dad jokes down below. Right, so hello again everybody and welcome back. Quick video today, but a lot of people are asking how do you get developer options on a fire stick? It's very simple to do, I'm going to show you how to do it now. Right, so that being said, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and let's crack on. Right, so I'm on one of the newer second generation Fire Sticks that were brought out in 2023, but it's going to work the same on any Amazon device. And also, let me know in the comment section down below, did this work for you or are you having problems enabling developer options? Right, so like I say, it's a very quick video because it's so simple to do. This is a brand new Fire Stick 4K. I've only just set it up. If I go across to settings... And that's the cog over here on the end. And then I go down. You're going to see where it says My Fire TV. Now, if you're using an actual Fire TV, it may say device and software. But on Amazon devices like a Fire Stick or a Fire TV Cube, it will say My Fire TV. And if we click on this, it's going to take us through to this part. So it says About, and that's the bit we want to click again. So Enter. And then what you're going to see now, it's going to say the device model. So for me, it says Fire TV Stick 4K. For you, it may say Fire TV Stick 4K Max. And if I quickly just go back, you can see there's no developer options there. So if I go back into About, and then once again, where it says the name of my device, I'm simply going to click on that seven times. You are now one step away, and then it says, no need, you are already a developer. Now, if I click the back button, you're going to see we now have developer options underneath there. We can click on that, and now we have the option to install unknown apps. And if I click on this, at the moment I've got no applications installed such as Downloader and that, so it's not giving me no options. But if I did have applications in there that could download to the Fire Stick, it would let me turn unknown sources on. And that's simply how to enable developer options on a new Amazon Fire TV Stick. So if you're somebody that likes side-loading apps that aren't available in the Amazon App Store, you're golden now, you can use Downloader or whatever you want. And another good thing when it comes to streaming is a VPN. If you don't use one already, I'd recommend trying one. And I'll leave a link to NordVPN in the comments section down below to get the best offer. And it's also a good way of supporting the channel because it is an affiliated link. So if you use my links, I want to say thank you very much. And yeah, whether you've got the new Fire TV... I've just dropped everything. <laughs> but yeah, if you've got the new Fire TV Stick 4K second gen, the new Fire TV Stick 4K Max second gen, or any Amazon streaming device, that's how to turn on developer options. And I just hope this video helped those of you that were wondering. Right, so that being said, I hope you enjoyed the rest of your day. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. And I'll see you soon. Ta-da!